In this video, we will be discussing grade 10 equations and inequalities. Remember this rule though. This is very, very, very important. What you do to the left hand side, you do to the right hand side. Very, very important. Let's do an example. Solving linear equations as follows. We start off by saying 4 with our brackets 2x minus 9 and then minus 4x is equal to 4 minus 6x. Right, so we work with uh, our 4 on the outside of the brackets. We multiply in 4 times 2x is 8x. 4 times minus 9 is minus 36. We carry the minus 4x and we leave the right hand side as it is. We then group our like terms. All the x's go to the one side. So we take this 6x to the one side. So we'll have also take 36 across, but remember the signs change. When you jump across an equal sign, your sign changes. That's why we've got the red circle around the plus and the minus. So when you take the minus 6x across, it becomes plus 6x. Now when you take the minus 36 across the equal sign, it becomes plus 36. So now we do our basic algebra. You have 10x is equal to 40. 10 divided by 10 is 1, and 40 divided by 10 is 4. This gives you x is equal to 4. Easy game. You can even check this answer. So, when x is equal to 4, 4 times 2x minus 9 minus 4x is equal to 4 minus 6x. What we do now is we sub the 4 into any place where there is an x. So I've done this in blue, and you can clearly see what I've done. So it's a 4 wherever there's an x, you put brackets around the x, and instead of putting an x, you put a 4. So let's calculate the left-hand side, and let's calculate the right-hand side. If we get the same answer at the end, x equals 4 is correct. So 8 minus 9 is minus 1. You're left with minus 20 on the left and you're left with minus 20 on the right. Let's go and do that. You see minus 20 in green, it's green for go, and blue for beautiful. <laughs> and therefore, we have left-hand side equal to our right-hand side. Easy game.